let's go to the woods and no bad story ever started with those five words it was a really frosty very chilly Saturday morning fog's taken hours to clear I've had bits and bobs to do and now the sun's starting to break through and we're gonna head to the woods for a, a few hours and just set up a little day camp I'm just gonna get out and just enjoy some peace amongst the trees let's go come on Catch you in a bit. Hey, how are we doing? It's JJ. We just parked up and uh, we're heading off to the woods. As I say, it's, uh, it's chilly, but the temperature has uh, slightly improved. Got myself a couple of cut lengths of uh, hazel. I'll sort of generally keep in the garage and that for when I want to set up the half lavu, which is what I'm going to use today. And uh, this is the little local wood that's close to me that I can use. And we've just parked up, we're walking away from the traffic, and I've got, uh, you can't quite see it, but I've got the Cow Raven stub and pack, a couple of little lights, woolen blankets put down on top of a ground sheet. I'm just gonna go and get set up. So uh, I'm just gonna walk away, get away from the road, disappear into the woods and just get out. Just make a little bit of time for yourself and enjoy. So handy, convenient tree, place those against, come back in a little bit later. Glorious. So what I want to do is, um, with these staves, is what I've already done on this one, if you can see, is cut a notch out, gone in, down, just taken out, and that's what I'm going to do with this one now. Just a smaller one on this one. So it slots in. It's quite a safe sort of technique for using a saw on this. Cross under one leg, bring this leg up, sort of braces it, holds it, stabilizes it. out with one of the other knives and that today needs a bit of a cleanup actually um, it's kind of been stored in the in the garage for a while it's carbon steel and it's got a bit damp so I need to give the metal work a little bit of TLC so this is the uh, mark one bush grass the mark one bore from the bushcraft store I'm just gonna take some of the little bits off of that Cham for the edges. So that these slot, you can't see from the camera, but they slot and hold together a lot better. So it'll actually hold the lash more securely rather than running down on itself. So I'm going to now get this lashed up and we'll get the lavu set up right so there's my setup so with the the cut the sorry the cut notches into the two poles I've lashed over the top and around done the lashing around it 
so I'm not actually going through the buttonholes with my top ridge line it's literally around the poles which then holds the torch and then the ridge line all the way over to there on that tree and I've just got a standard you know five pound DPM basic ground sheet underneath that and then I've got an outhouse woolen blanket which is nice to sit on nice and warm and I've just got my little bits of day camp stuff set up just to have a brew and I'm going to use the firebox first time this year in January using the firebox I'm going to use the eagle kettle and have a brew and as I say let's go to the woods it's never a bad story when you hear them words chaps and ladies Nice little bit of woodland to sit in. the first of many firebox burns of 2022. What a great way to enjoy it. It's about 20 minutes or so before sunset. Let this get going. Oh, nothing better. down in a in a minute although I've been out several times in the last few weeks I've just been enjoying using the brass mess burner but you can't beat a fire using a firebox stove which is what I'm known for fantastic let's just move that Happy days right there, I can tell you. It's nothing but bird song. Yeah, happy days. Just get out and enjoy. It's so good for your mental well-being, your mental health, your mental state of mind. And uh yeah. Can't ask for much more than that, really. Can't ask for much more than that. Let me just get the coffee prepped. Happy days. Just find your place in nature. Get outside, enjoy, make a little bit of time for yourself. Which is what I love doing. All right, we'll wait for that to boil. We'll have a brew. Oh, I'm so happy. Watch that ridge line. Not a beer, but cheers. Bloody hot. <laughs> every time, every time.
hope everyone's kind of enjoying the videos that I'm putting out at the moment. I'm really enjoying doing it and uh, just making the time when I can. And I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it, so I hope you enjoy. It's going to start getting dark in a bit. I won't do too much filming. Don't want it to be really. I'm trying to sort of cut my video lengths down. I know some people are really, really into the long ones, but uh, that's just that's not me. There are certain occasions when that's right, but just short ones, under 20 minutes. Try and keep them around to a 13, 14 minutes or under if I can. Makes it easy to watch, and more enjoyable. Starting to plan a couple of meetups with some uh, some guys, and uh, can't can't wait. Got a few trips planned, so uh, I've already sort of touched on that a little bit in a couple of videos. But yeah, plans are now starting to come towards fruition. Some day camps and some overnight camps. That's going to make for some really good videos, and just enjoying the company that I'm with. So listen, I'm going to enjoy this little bit of time to myself now. You've seen enough. Thanks for tuning in. We'll catch up again soon. Oh, don't forget, hit that subscribe button so you know when the videos are coming out. Give it a like if you're enjoying the videos and if you really like what you see, subscribe away. Subscribe away. Listen, I'm waffling. Catch you later. Brew time. Happy. Let's go to the woods. And to the woods we went. See you later.